Hey, 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 folks, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a, um, a pigtail split piece soup, right? This this recipe was requested by June. Um, I don't know how to pronounce her, her surname, so I would not attempt in, in fear of butchering her surname, all right? So here we go. So this is the list of ingredients. I have some carrot here. Um, this is three tablespoons of green seasoning, homemade green seasoning. I have some, my probably ground, ground provision of choice is Tanya. I also have some edos. I'll, I'll put a small, a few pieces of that. And this is some pixel to the back already um, tenderized. I have here, this is one cup of yellow split peas and some pumpkin. And this is my dough to make. I'm going to make some um, spinners, spinners dumplings. So I'm just going to put everything in the pot, put that in the stove and allow it to boil. Simple as that. Well, except, in it, <laughs> except for the, the, um, the, the dumplings, I'm going to do that after. And I'm not going to put in the tang yet. I'm going to allow the piece to cook and get nice and tender before adding, before adding these two ingredients. That was the split peas. I'm going to add the carrots. That was just one medium sized grated carrot, pumpkin, green seasoning, pigtail. You could put more pigtail if you want. Eh? If you love a pigtail like me, you could put more pigtail. But remember, the pigtail has salt, so as you would notice, I didn't, um, salt wasn't one of the list of ingredients. I'm gonna add some water about four to six cups of water because it might take about 25 minutes for the piece to get nice and tender so I added six cup of six, six cups of water so I'm gonna turn off the stove and allow this everything to cook and the piece to get nice and tender okay so this is about approximately 30 minutes since after I added the water the pizza now is nice and tender, right? And you can see most of the water has already boiled down. So I'm going to add the other ingredients. Of course, I'll have to add more water. That is some seasoning pepper that I found in the kitchen. In the fridge. I'm gonna add a bit of black pepper. Of course, you could add more like pepper if you want it to be more spicy my grandson like the dumplings in the soup so I'm not going to put any pepper I'm going to add my ground provision at this point like I said I have the tanya and I have some edos the edos get nice and soft and it kind of like thickens the soup Now I'm going to add some water. Excellent. When this water, water become, when this water comes up boil, I'm going to begin to make the dumplings and drop them in the spinners. Okay folks, my pigtail soup is all done. Dumplings, the spinners are all added. The peas nice and tender, and it's tasting good. So I'm gonna turn off the stove and do a presentation for you. Yeah, baby. Okay folks, here's my split peas pigtail soup with some spinners, super delicious. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, click the thumbs up button, leave a comment for me and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to click on the bell next to the subscribe button in doing so, you get a notification each time I upload a new video. Okay, thanks so much for watching, take care, bye bye.